everyone, it's Nana A. Welcome back to my channel. We're here today. This is where our classroom slash library playground is going to be. This is what we're building for Lobo and Cleo. Their hobby is um, education. So we're going to give them a classroom that they can teach, even set up a little experiment area. So if they're not teaching, they want to experiment a library so they can read. This is going to be for the whole island, but they're going to be in charge of it. So let's get to building. I'm just going to let you enjoy the music and watch the build for a little bit. I'm going to go with um, the in-game path for the floor of the school. It's the, um, not the stone path, but the other one, the fancy stone path. I am going to have to move this back some more. I decided I needed just a little bit more room. And I decided to go with the setup of the teacher desk up front. And then I'm going to have four student desks. One of different colors you can see, but we're going to change that. And I'm using the homework set um, to be like their schoolwork on their desk that they're working on. And of course the whiteboard, the blackboard, the skeleton, and the human anatomy man, as I call him. I think they call it anatomical man or something. I went with the iron and stone fence here because I wanted to separate it from Lobo's house. I want it to be a part of his and Cleo's um, area up here, but I wanted to separate it from their fencing. hard time deciding what to do with the corner. And also whether I should put the fence on that side or leave it off. So I'm really not sure at this point, but we're going to see how it goes. Over here will be our uh, laboratory area. And 
and we'll have a telescope. Gotta have lighting. And I still do not like that open area in back. I want it to be outside, but seem like it's inside. No OSHA views for the classroom. This is going to be our library slash uh, small playground. So I had to go and add some more because we still want to have a walkway because we're going to have to add our pathway for Leah, uh, Cleo and Lobo. I decided to combine their names, I guess. And at some point, we're going to have to put an incline up there. So, be plenty of room. And the trees and flowers are going to have to at least move over. And definitely have to build it out some so we can fit the, the library there. Now I'll tell you the inspiration for the library is actually, actually a little shout out to my daughter Amber. She has a YouTube channel, or I guess they call it BookTube, and the name of it is Second Hand Reader. And you should really check it out if you haven't already, because I have mentioned it before. She gives some good reviews, and I am so proud that even an author watched her reviews and liked how she did her reviews so he sent his book to her that is not out yet for her to read and give him a review so I think that's pretty cool but the reason why her channel is called secondhand reader is she does a lot of thrift shopping for books she has quite an extensive library but has not paid an arm and a leg for Sometimes she only pays like 20 cents a book. So my library that's going to be outside, kind of combined with the playground, is going to have small libraries. Um, probably three on one side and two on the other. That's what I was kind of uh, looking at here. And that's because she visits a lot of free libraries also, the little libraries that people have at their house or they have by businesses that people just go and take books or uh, put books in and so I thought that I would kind of take that for her and you'll see but again second hand reader y'all check her out you'll like her channel Now back to building. See? Little libraries. And put some books on top here. Okay, there's a few things that I need to get, and um, I had to order them. So we're going to have to do a little time traveling so we can get our items in. So get your popcorn and your drink. Settle in, and I will be right back. Okay, we're back. And I have put up uh, some window panels. 
which I did not do, so I will put any of the uh, designs from the portal down in the description. I did not do the window or the simple panel of books, but I did make the two library walls. I could not make up my mind how I wanted this. So we're going to go through a few changes. I like the way it ends up. Give the teacher a laptop and I changed the books for a stack of papers or magazines but they look like little work books to hand out to the students so I liked that. Move everything over. You see we have the lab experiment, then the microscope, then the telescope for our lab area. A little lava lamp lighting and some plants just to spruce the place up a little and of course we're going to have to put our other bookcase over there with our books on it put some chairs for somebody to sit at the table and read Lobo's fence back. I don't like that it has the little part you can see the water, but I could not fill that in with anything. From here, the lamp hides it, so until I move it. <laughs> And of course we have to have our Texas flag. We're going to put some flowers here. Just to show this is outside. Of course we have the dirt in-game pathway. And I decided to take the ride-ons out. And just leave the play gym. Make this a, a small play area. Okay, we have our little library with all of our books and the globes. They want to see where they are at in the world. Maybe we're on there. And then we have our play gym over here, just a small one. 
in our place to read the books or sit in color or sit and reflect. You never know what somebody wants to do. But this is our library with a playground inside of it. And then we have our classroom. We'll go over one more time. We have the teacher's desk and the student desk. And then our windows and our wall of books. And our skeleton so we can study the 206 bones of our bodies. And then the human anatomy person so we can our anatomical man, I should say, so we can study human anatomy. Which is, I guess, kind of messed up since most of them are animals. But, that's neither here nor there. We have some plants and lava lights. Of course, our state flag. And our lab area, our telescope so we can see the stars. And then here we have our class hamster, Hammy. Everybody loves Hammy. We all take care of him. He is so cute. Running in his wheel. And of course we have the blackboard. And then the whiteboard over there. Just making sure that we can walk through. Yeah, human anatomy. Well, we don't have an animal anatomy, so we're going to have to go with our anatomical man. Okay. Well, well, this is our classroom and our library. I hope you've enjoyed the build today. I have, and now we have our second area, which is for the purple villagers, Cleo and Lobo, Hobby of Education. So if you like the builds and you like this video, hit the like button down below. That means a lot to me. It lets me know what videos you like to see. And hit that subscribe button. I want you to become part of the family. Come on down. And of course, hit that notification bell so you can see when my next video comes out. And until then, bye y'all.